getting stops. When we get stops, we always go on runs and we let them get easy buckets, so that was the problem. That's why it was up at first. Yeah, she did. I mean, whenever Kirstie's open, we just tell her to shoot. She just got to shoot. Sometimes she doesn't. When she does, we're a better team. So. Yep, it's only before the game. I'm sitting on the bench right before tip. The knocking three threes today and got it done. Um, not really. I mean, I've been getting some extra shots up and it's really helped my confidence, so let's carry it over to Saturday. Uh, we knew we just had a lock in on defense. We were making some kind of silly mistakes on defense, not rotating correctly, and uh, we we fixed that up and locked in on the post and got it done. Um, she's an, uh, she's a trem tremendous post player. Um, she's tough to guard. She can shoot it out like from the three point line at a very high level, and then she can go in and just get it done around the post. So um, just being assignment correct. You know, we had um, reading the side ball, and then we had some subs come in. We had to like switch that, so we just had to make sure we're communicating and. Uh, letting each other know what, what was about to happen. Well, this was a weird game. I thought we, we made a lot of like mental mistakes in what we do. Uh, things I haven't seen lately or for a while. Uh, and it wasn't just one person. It was several different people just doing one thing. It wasn't a continuous thing. So it was weird. I thought it was a strange game for us. Um, you know, we were able to make shots early. Uh, but they're a good offensive team. I think they're top four in the league in, in MIAA playing and scoring offense. And they, they're able to do some things with different players that put some pressure on you defensively. Uh, and I thought our second half defense was a lot better. You know what? I told her before the game, why don't you have a game tonight, make about three threes, and I'll be darned if she can get three for three from the three-point line. And um, You know, those were big ones. Um, one time I called her number on accident, and she came through and made it. Um, we got her another time, and she got that one, and, and then hit a big one there late. Uh, at the top of the key too so it, it's really you know having somebody like her come off the bench and play really good defense and rebound and then being able to hit timely threes is is a big luxury for us yeah uh, you know they really don't they let you throw it in there they use their size like we do most of the time and try to play behind and just make it tough to score over the top and she's just really skilled has good touch around the basket and if you play her one-on-one -on -one, she's probably going to get some on you um, and do a good job in there